Section two, marketing summary. Let's go over what we just went through. The first thing we went over was company overview. In this section, you described what your company was, what it is they do, the who, what, the when, the where, the how. That's all up in the company overview. Then we talked about the distribution channel. How does your product get to the customers? Do you have a retail facility? Just talk about how it physically gets there, right? This is the process. So think supply chain. Product development. If you're a service company, you can kind of just talk about some of the ins and outs that are specific to a service company. But if you're a product development, think about how do you manufacture your product? Are you buying your product manufactured? Are you yourself manufacturing it? Answer those questions in product development. Then we have customer analysis. So you're going to think about who is your target customer? What is their age? What is the demographic? Things like that. Figure out what your customer analysis, you can figure out your target market. Once you know your target market, then you're going to go ahead and look at your industry analysis. And remember, we wanted to use some statistics here. Let's put a numerical value to the size of your market. Then we went into competition, because once we understand our industry, we want to know who else is competing in the industry. And there were two key parts in this competitive analysis. We had the competition, so think your direct and indirect competitors, their strengths, their weaknesses, right? And then most importantly, competitive advantage. Remember, this was a one to two second blurb that said why your company is unique and different from your competition. This is important, so make sure it's in there and make sure it's good. Then we talked about the marketing plan. The marketing plan was advertising. How are we going to market our company to people? How are customers going to know that your company is real, that it's open, that it's active, right? So we listed a couple different methods to so just kind of figure out what is your best way of advertising. And get creative if you want to. SWOT. Then we talked about SWOT. So this is strengths and weaknesses, which are internal, and opportunities and threats, which are external. So think about the different factors and you should be good to go. If at any point you're a little bit confused, you can always go back and rewatch the videos. And you also have the Yotes Co. example in front of you, so feel free, feel free to read through that business plan, compare it with what we've talked about in these videos, and hopefully you'll be able to create a great section too.